Hey, Kevin Xasha here with another video. Today, yeah, a new event came out, but I'm afraid I beat the event without you. As you can see. I did not do that. I did not. Um, I only did it up to tier 7. I didn't do tier 8 because I bought the pack that comes with it, so I didn't need tier 8. And also, since with all the gold, I decided to buy the Gartel Machine Gun. But today, guys, we're going to be reviewing the Lucky Set. Now, if you're still using the event and you get this, it does points times two. So one Shamrock is equal to two Shamrocks. So, and then it gives you the Lucky Rifle. The Lucky Rifle, um, guys, um, it's a... It's a balanced weapon. It's like the stick rifle. It's balanced. But guys, let me give you a heads up. I'm going to do two back-to-back -back videos. Stay tuned, because next video I'm going to be explaining. They buffed the Fire Spader. The Fire Spader is now an OP weapon. Remember how I said that it takes a long time to kill? They they buffed that. They fixed it. This it now kills instantly. This is what it used to beat the event. It got everybody. But guys, let's get to the this. Let's get to this. The lucky rifle. Three damage, two range, two accuracy, four agility. And this weapon increases the damage by a hundred percent for a short time after you get a headshot. So if you get a headshot, it doubles the damage or increases the damage by a hundred percent. The lucky hat. Seven percent plus seven percent agility. And if you're doing the event right now, turn two times two points. You get a short reload speed boost when you get a long range headshot reward. The lucky braces, plus 12 health, and it's and you heal for a small amount when you get a triple kill reward. The lucky socks, seven agility. You get a short defense boost against any weapon when you get a double kill using a gadget. So guys, this is the lucky thing again. Remember, stay tuned, because I'm going to be doing this, oh, how they fixed it, and after that, three back-to-back -back videos on my new top ten weapons that I have. So, guys, let's try this out in this. Let's try this out in story mode. You see, I look pretty cool. See, it's very balanced. It, it, can, it kills quickly, but it's not overpowered. It kills very quickly, but it's not overpowered. It's like the Stig Rifle. Help. A lot of people say the Stig Rifle is not overpowered, and it's not um, too weak. It's balanced. This is like the Stig Rifle. This is, this, this is like a little stronger than the Stig Rifle. It's, this is like the stick rifle on small, tiny steroids. You can get... In... It's really good in, um, multi in the multiplayer, but if you have this pack, don't use it for the events. Try using it for the events. This won't get you nowhere in the events. This is not the weapon to use for the event. The weapon to use for the event is... If you have it, the fire spinner. Also, the Dobro shotgun. Now, in the parade week, you you could have you could have got the Dobro shotgun for free in week three if you beat the f fourth tier. So actually, to tell you the truth, the the, shot, the Dobro shotgun is actually the recommended weapon. They they should have made the fire spinner a recommended weapon. The fire spinner is all freaking peak. I love all freaking sudden. So guys, yeah. This is like this is so it's like the review of the lucky pack and just yeah, enjoy the video. Also guys, the damage depends on range. This thing does more damage close range. Less damage for range. This has 25 ammo in a clip. 
it has a good look to the gun. It's a good looking gun. By the way, this video is gonna be a little short because it's it's on um, ten o'clock at night, Saturday. So I was gonna do one little battle with you, show you how the lucky rifle, lucky pack works. So yeah, take it to my channel. Remember, don't leave because right after this, I'm gonna be uploading another vid. Then after that, another vid. So three videos back to back. Stay tuned for that, and peace out.